Hi, and welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 2. This video presentation is going to be on Proposition 3 of Book 2, which states that if you have a line segment AB, which I will call A, and it's cut into two arbitrary lengths den denoted by C, so we have a line segment of X and a line segment of Y, then the rectangle formed by A and Y, in other words, AY, will equal to this segment CB squared, or Y squared, plus the rectangle formed by AC and CB, or in other words, equals to X times Y. And since A is equal to X plus Y, what we're really showing here, algebraically, is that X plus Y times Y is equal to Y squared plus x times y. But we are going to show this using geometry rather than algebra. So the first thing we're going to do is to draw a square on CB. Then we're going to draw a line perpendicular, sorry, we're going to draw a line parallel to CD from the point A to the point F and extend the line DE to the point F. So these are all rectangles which means that the line segment AF is equal to the line segment CD. Since this is a square, CD is equal to CB. Now the first thing to note is that the rectangle AF is equal to the sum of the rectangle AD plus the rectangle CE. What we also need to know about this rectangle AE that it is equal to AB times AF. But AF is equal to CD is equal to CB. So in other words, this rectangle AE is equal to AB times CB. Now this light purple rectangle AD is equal to AC times AF or AC times CB. And this rectangle, CE, is equal to CB all squared, since that's what, how we drew it. So now if we look at what we have, we have an equation for the equality of the rectangles and a definition of what those rectangles are. And we end up with CB times AB, CB times AB, is equal to CB times AC plus CB squared. And just to recap, what I'm going to do is, if this is length X and this is length Y, this is Y squared, this length is Y, and this is XY. So X plus Y times Y is equal to XY plus, sorry, equals to xy plus y squared. And there you have it. And that concludes this video presentation. To see the next presentation, just click the next button.